Hello everyone. Let's continue our lesson English language year 2 with the topic of the robot. You may refer your Supermind textbook page 102 and you're going to do this lesson with me your teacher and my name is Amira. Welcome to all of you to this class this time. I need you to be ready. Please set up your study space and be ready. Turn to page 102 of Supermind's textbook. We're going to have fun learning for today's lesson. Hurry up and be ready. At the end of the lesson, you should be able to match skeleton with its actions. And you should be able to match skeleton with the animals. First, Let's have a look at these pictures. Say with me, skeleton, skeleton. Now, look at all of these skeletons. Number one, number two, number three, number four. Number five, number six, and number seven. I hope you already look carefully at all of the skeletons. Before we begin, can you tell what is the skeleton functions or what is the skeleton do? What can the skeleton do for our body? Now, say with me, you're going to look at the pictures and say with me. Jump. Jump. Dance, dance, stand, stand, sit, sit, walk, walk. Run, run, swim, swim. Now, let's look at the skeletons again. I guess you can already guess what the skeleton can do. So, what is the skeleton do? Can you tell what the skeleton do? Yes. Jump. Jump. Next. What is the skeleton do? What is the skeleton do? Dance, dance. Next, what is the skeleton do? Stand, the skeleton stand. What the skeleton do now? Can you tell what the skeleton do now? Yes, sit, sit. Next, what the skeleton do now? What the skeleton do now? Walk, yes, walk. Now, what the skeleton do? 
run, run. Can you tell what the skeleton do? Swim, swim. So, we can have the conclusion here. Skeleton help us to move. Skeleton can make our body to do actions such as walk, swim, run, dance, stand and swim. Skeleton help us to move our body. Let's have a look at the animals and their skeletons. We're going to have a look at the animals and skeletons because animals also have their own skeleton. This will help them to move too. First one is penguin. Look carefully how the skeleton of the penguin look like. It's very interesting. Penguin. Next, giraffe. Giraffe. Wow, the skeleton for the giraffe neck is very long. Look carefully how the skeleton of giraffe look like. It's very interesting, right? Next, monkey. Monkey. Wow, the skeleton of the monkey has a very long tail. This is how the skeleton of monkey look like. Next, crocodile. Crocodile. Wow. The skeleton of the crocodile jaw is very large and look very strong. Wow. Crocodile skeleton. Next, rat. Rat. The skeleton of the rat is very small. This is the picture of the skeleton of the rat. It's really interesting. Alright girls, so for today we already look about, we already look at human skeleton and the animal's skeleton. So for today's Main task. You need to complete page 102 and 103 of Supermind's workbook. Please submit this main task before 5 pm today. You may take your pencil to circle page 102 and 103 of Supermind workbook. You need to complete these pages for your main tasks. Additional tasks. Please complete page 49 and 50 of Buku Rampayan Super. This task can be submitted after 5 p.m. today. Take your pencil and circle page 49 and 50 of Buku Rampayan Super, the brown book. This is your additional task. You can submit this task after 5 p.m. That's all for today. Thank you for attending today's class. See you next time. Oh, don't forget to please refer to your Google Classroom for further instructions. Goodbye.